Ripple XRP bull trend change confirmation. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel and in today's video guys I'll be analysing Ripple XRP. I'll be talking about what we want to see in the chart to confirm a potential bull trend change. Also guys I'll talk about some of the fundamental news. I might make a longer video in the future to share with you my thoughts on Ripple XRP fundamentals when the price will go up. In this video is more about technical analysis price prediction. So guys what we're looking to see here is guys this red zone as you can see ripple has come up here three times tag this level and is forming higher lows so this could be a zone potentially if it breaks out it could be very very bullish for xrp at least in the short term so it depends on what your time frame is whether you are an investor or a trader i highly recommend you check my video out where i talked about trading versus investing if you're investing this is this video is not really for you you might want to understand what's going on with the price and you can understand it that better if you're investing you're thinking long term i presume you'll be thinking of okay this is potentially a good zone to buy because as you can see even from an investing point of view xrp has been here one two potentially three times and it has rallied uh, massively and you can also take a small trade here or you know see okay if xrp stays below this uh, this red zone if you like xrp from from a price point of view you could say okay if it holds below this red zone and it breaks out i'm gonna buy with stop below and see if i can ride a trend or catch a big move up that that is a strategy people use what i like to do is i'm more of a trader and um, i like to see a trend change i mean i keep going on about the same thing again and again a higher high a higher low and a higher high so xrp is trying to do something similar Again, chart is not always perfect, and you can see it's trying to do on a weekly time frame as well. So this will be the weekly trend change break above here. On the daily, this will be the daily uh, trend change. And if you are more aggressive and you like trading uh, in the short time frame, you could look to buy a a, a breakout out of there. If you're more short term trading, then sorry if you're longer term trading you probably want a weekly trend change. It depends on your risk appetite. If you look at my Litecoin trade this has been again if you've not subscribed to my channel I highly recommend you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button uh, so you do not miss any of my videos so again this is something again, I I'm not talking about after the fact I traded it live and as you can see Litecoin had a daily trend change here but it had a weekly trend change after even if you traded the weekly trend change you still would have got in at 41 and you had a big move up even after that so you should not really think about uh, it shouldn't be too risky and take the daily trend changes because you might miss uh, it, it's riskier because daily trend changes can happen and and you might not uh, get the best entry so i'm looking at litecoin as well and ethereum i think something is going on interesting that i'm not too sure i'm, I'm in ethereum already and in, i'm still in litecoin as well and i think something's going on with altcoins and i'm not i can't put a finger on it and it seems really interesting uh, what might be happening with with altcoins i'm gonna make it go live uh, this week at some point and if you have not subscribed to my channel make sure you have so you're notified I'll, I'll let you guys know when I do go live there are some coins I'm looking to buy there's two coins I'm gonna make a video in a bit I'll post the signals in our free Facebook group if you're interested I'll post signals technical analysis on there that they're almost daily I try to keep you guys up to date with news so I'll post two signals in there this is an XRP video I'm getting carried away it's a similar setup to to XRP you know it's, it's at a massive weekly zone as you can see it's come back here a few times and bounced seems to like people seem to be buying XRP when it comes to this level and if it does make that daily trend change it's already above my 20 moving average but I want to see a strong close above it then XRP could have a nice little rally. So that is my thoughts on XRP. My first target would be around uh, 30 cent, 29 cent zone. And if it can get above that, then this could be very, very interesting. But let's not get too excited. Let's trade uh, short term. So the trend change confirmation will be a higher, high, higher low, and a higher high. That is what we would like. Uh, that's what we'd like to see. I also like to keep on what's going on with the news, guys. Um, and there doesn't seem to be too much news going on. But what something that's kind of caught my eyes is kind of xrp fork unlikely to succeed and brad garling has been talking about it someone on twitter with over a hundred thousand followers is trying to um 
make a Twitter persona saying stop ripple uh, dumping. I'm gonna do my, my a bit more research and I'll have a video out uh, by end of next week on ripple. And then there's another video I want to make on XRP. It's um, to do with XRP fundamentals where I talk about what my thoughts are on XRP. You know the myths, myth like maybe a myth buster video where I talk about you know some of the wrong things people say about XRP. So I might make that video as well. And again, I'm not as you might know, I'm not a huge fan of XRP like some of the other. YouTubers who just constantly keep pumping XRP. I tried to take from it, to use my trading experience to trade XRP. So I'll share with you my uh, analysis and my years of experience in, in trading stocks and then and a couple of years for trading crypto. So I'll make that video, uh, probably that Mythbuster will be longer video, so that will probably be next week or try to do it end of the week. But I'll definitely have a Ripple XRP video out talking about this uh, XRP fork again. That's kind of caught me. Uh, caught me by surprise really I'm going to do a bit more research and have that video out so coming back to the price I'll run the finish of the video a XRP on a high time frame it is at a massive zone XRP shouldn't break below it uh, this support should hold at least for a small rally and that is what we're trying to catch and look for a break above this red zone to trade above uh, what I will do is some people if you've not got en uh, enough time you'll just try to buy a breakout above this what I like to do is I'll try to trade it like I've traded EOS again I've posted signals here if you if you want to learn more about trading uh, and my full trading course is available here I'll leave the link below where I post signals and how I'm trading exactly so I'd like to see a break above and then pull back moving average setup strategy that I teach to get in or if you've not got too much time you could look to buy a pullback here with the stop below uh, the, the the red zone which it shouldn't really break if you're still bullish so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button i'm back this week um, after a weekend off so i'll be making a lot more videos and bringing a lot of content including the two trade signals i'll be posting uh, later on today so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much